when I fly into a city, I look at a skyline and it looks like a mountain range to me. I was asked to come up with a big idea for Got Milk. But how cool would it be to put a climbing wall on top of a building in the middle of downtown Kansas City? There are a thousand reasons why this is a crazy shoot to put together. We literally had to build a wall on top of a 30-story building. We have multiple locations permits, insurance, obviously finding talent. You know, the first person that came to mind for me was Kai Leitner. I always look at buildings that I can climb when I'm in the city. Me and Jimmy, actually, we had a ton of mutual friends and it's great to be able to work with them. I've always been an inner city kid. And so it's kind of weird climbing a climbing wall that's in the middle of downtown Kansas City. It feels like both of my worlds are clashing together and it's, it's really cool. Growing up in the inner city, a lot of my peers didn't really relate to what I did. For a lot of kids in these communities, climbing is unfamiliar and climbing is a pretty predominantly white sport. And so when you're stepping in, it's easy to be discouraged when you're not represented anywhere in the sport. Yeah! Kai really represents the future of climbing. He's won multiple national titles. This is pretty sick, dude. I think my ultimate goal, by the time I guess I'm, I'm gone from the sport, long gone, would be to leave a, a legacy in a way that I give more opportunities to kids who are uh, come from more diverse backgrounds. All right, and action cut. Climbing's in this new place now where it's much more mainstream. It's about to go to the Olympics. You're seeing climbing gyms pop up in accessible areas for inner city kids, for more diverse communities. And so just knowing that like stepping out of your comfort zone can pay off if you just have the drive and dedication to pursue the sport. I wanna be able to open these doors and walk through them and then leave them open for the next generation of kids who look like me.